everybody. Thanks for checking out my infrared sump vlog. Okay, so I have my headphones in because I was on a run today. And I think I'm probably recording through my headphones, but whatever. So this is where I sit in my infrared sauna and I sweat it out and I completely detox and I meditate and burn calories and talk about all types of spiritual topics that I want to study so that I can really manifest and really understand the spiritual laws that we have to deal with living in this dimension on this planet. So I just went through um, a series of 12 or 13 vlogs, 14 actually, on the 12 universal laws, basically the 12 energetic laws that we have to understand in order to really manifest here. And um, so I would suggest really studying that because it has absolutely transformed my life, like literally transformed my life. I mean, I can't even believe it. It's so exciting and really like real magic, you know, it's taking back the control <laughs> instead of being a victim and being like, holy shit, everything's falling apart. You're manifesting everything you want in your life. And it is really once you get it, it's just become second nature, man. And it feels so much better because I, you know, like you can spend your time complaining and bitching and being miserable and unhappy, or you can just live in a state of absolute gratitude and bliss. And it's really about taking control of your thoughts. I mean, that's the overall thing. You've got to manage your thoughts. And I think I mentioned in a previous blog vlog that, um, I used to have a mantra or I still have it. It's, and I used to tap, tap when I was saying it over and over and it just prevented more than anything. Cause it wasn't really like manifesting so much specifically, but it was, um, preventing me from having free floating anxiety type thinking. You know what I mean? Like instead of having my mind wander about, Oh, anxiety, this anxiety that I was really just repeating. I'm healthy, wealthy, wise, and worthy. And I believe it changes the cells in your body when you repeat something over and over, as long as you believe it. And even if you don't believe it, just repeat it because it's certainly better than emotionally charged thoughts going out into the universe that are negative. And that's the topic, topic I want to talk about today because it's so important and it's so easy to figure out because you can feel it in your body. So this is the deal. When you have anxiety, there's emotion attached to those feelings and thoughts. And so when you're worrying, those thoughts are emotionally charged with fear, energetically charged with fear. And there is being sent out into the universe by your powerful mind to manifest. Okay. That is like heavy because think about that. Every thought that has an emotion attached becomes very highly energetically charged to manifest. So your emotions and that that's today's vlog topic. Your emotions are absolutely critical. I'm a very, very emotional person because I have a moon in cancer and I have cancer rising and they kind of contradict my Aquarian sun, but they have those two um, aspects in my birth chart have really, I don't want to say plagued me, but required me to really have some lessons in life because I would say that my emotions have been my Achilles heel and not being able to really manage them. You know, like basically I turn my head to the side and I cry. So, but, and there's nothing wrong with that because you can certainly have tears of joy. I believe me, I do all the time, all the time. And it's a beautiful feeling to be able to allow that to happen without judgment. But what I'm talking about here is emotions that are attached to thoughts or actions or you know, whatever, your writings. If you have emotions that are attached to something that you're trying to manifest or inadvertently thoughts that you're having, they're going to supercharge those thoughts. They're going to supercharge those actions. Okay. So 
the trick is to identify your emotions and you can feel it in your body and you can certainly feel when you feel anxiety. For example, and this is a perfect example. Okay, so today I have money anxieties and I have my whole life and I'm 100% sure it was how I was programmed as a child and I know I'm going to go long today, but whatever. And so my programming from zero to seven was that of lack and anxiety around it. Um, and so I have to reprogram those thoughts because for so many years in my younger years, I would have anxiety around money, right? So for example, today I wanted to, my birthday's in a couple of days and I wanted to buy a juicer, right? And they're hundreds and hundreds of dollars. And I didn't want to just get a crappy little break next week type juicer. I wanted to get a real deal. Let's get busy and have some real raw nutrition coming into the physical body, right? But I was like, oh, you know, whatever, it's $400. But this is the trick. Change the emotion around the purchase. Feel grateful that you have the money to buy it. Feel grateful already that it's going to give you so much health and abundant um, physical vibration raising nutrients. Feel the gratitude in the purchase instead of the fear and the anxiety. See, it changes everything. So when you're going through life, you can feel how you feel throughout your day and you can note, make a note of the things that you, when you're just doing whatever, thinking whatever, that you feel anxiety or fear or stress around. Make note of those things because that's where the work needs to be done to transmute that energy Transmute it. That's one of the universal laws that we can change the energy and make it a more high vibration energy with more positive emotions attached. And then those thoughts and feelings, the energetic amplifier will be sent out to the universe to manifest more positive feelings and more positive abundance into your life. Like money or love or health or whatever. Emotions are the amplifier. Become aware of your emotions and you can completely transform your life. Whew, powerful stuff, baby. Okay, so I hope everybody has an amazing day, week, month. Whenever you watch this, I send blessings to everybody. Blessings from my heart to yours. Please, please reach out. Please comment and or message me. I am here for you. Please subscribe. I would love to interact and or help in any way that I can. Okay. And so. Oh.